Early in the morning, the buses roll in, one after the other, carrying thousands of fourth graders from across Santa Cruz County. Line up everyone, straight line please. With new t-shirts proclaiming their hopes for the future, the excitement is clear. These fourth graders get to be college students today. Good morning, boys and girls. After a brief welcoming ceremony, and it's at the bottom of the stadium, so come down. They're off to classes on the Cabrillo College campus. It's all part of a first-of-its-kind effort to plant the seed about future learning. This is all about creating a college-going culture so that, that kids early on start thinking about what they need to do to be ready to go to college. What might this be called? Santa Cruz County educators are joining forces to inspire these students to be college ready when they graduate from high school. We're planting the seeds right now about how they are, you know, how they're growing quickly and they need to be involved because they're, they're upper elementary right now. So it's the perfect time. Carrillo College calls this effort the Santa Cruz County College Commitment. It's an unprecedented effort between K-12 school districts, Cabrillo, Cal State Monterey Bay, San Jose State University, and UC Santa Cruz. On this day, Cabrillo College is hosting fourth graders from every public school district in Santa Cruz County. It feels awesome because I've never been in a college and today's my day. To, to, to learn about what fun it is to, to, to be in college and what, what good education you can get. To keep them motivated to attend college, next year these students will visit Cal State Monterey Bay's campus. And the year after that, UC Santa Cruz. What else can you get? From accounting to cooking to making rockets, these students get a real feel for life on a college campus. Cabrillo students serve as mentors for the day. The kids just have so much energy and they're really passionate about going to college and this is exciting for us to be like their first mentors to take them to the first step. The first step in this whole effort to inspire these youths to go to college started in 2007 when Barbara Samper, Cabrillo College's largest donor, had a vision. She started the Barbara Samper Foundation to help students achieve the dream of receiving a college education. If you can help me out and give Barbara a standing ovation for helping make this possible, she'll be able to know that you appreciate what she did. My big hope is that they're really internalizing this. The t-shirt isn't just on the outside, but that it's, it's kind of seeping through to their insides, that they really believe that they are future graduates. So, and I, I get the feeling that they do, they get this. I think it's absolutely good age, you know, I mean, they're not that far away from graduating from high school, even though you, it may seem pretty the young. The fourth graders, and they're, um, they can start making life choices and uh, showing responsibility for making goals, and I preach that all year long. So to get them with a hands-on experience of what college really is, um, it's wonderful. It's, it feels kind of cool and it feels um, awesome. So we're really excited at the high school level. I'm excited as a parent because my son is able to see a college. He already is telling me today, why do we have to have a chaperone? I want to walk around here by myself. So for him to actually know a little bit more what the college experience will be like is fantastic. The future is bright for the Sam Pair fourth grade experience. With a commitment from other educational institutions, as well as from Cabrillo College's dedicated faculty and staff, the message to these kids will continue. You should go to college. Yeah, like you should go to college. I want to be a doctor or an artist. I want to be a... I want to be a... I can't hear you guys. I want to be a doctor. I want to be a doctor. Say that one more time. I want to be a doctor. I want to be a dentist. I want to be an animal doctor. I want to be a vet.